in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. The Bible said in the book of John 1:1, 1, 1, in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. Heavenly Father, I thank you for your children. And I pray that today marks the beginning of a new thing in their life, in the name of Jesus. And I pray that your word, O oh Lord, brings blessing to this household. In the life of your son and your daughter, in the name of Jesus. Father, for everything that they've looked up to you to do for them, Father, do not withhold it. Let it be given to them in the name of Jesus. Every of their tears, O oh God, in secret, O oh God, and in the open, Father, answer to it in the name of Jesus. Thank you, sweet Holy Spirit. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Um, Sister Annabelle, the Lord will definitely meet you at the point of your need. I want you to understand that the Lord is on the throne. He has never changed and He will never change in your own situation. He will give you rest in every area. At the appointed time, do not give up. Okay? The Bible says in the book of Psalm 127 verse 3, it said, Lo, children are the heritage of the Lord, and the fruit of the womb, its reward. Your mother gave birth to you. You will give birth to yours. You will conceive at the appointed time. Don't get yourself worried and keep trusting in God, okay? Thank you, Father. You're welcome, my son. You're welcome. Son. Father. Don't worry. God will perfect everything. Put your trust in Him. Thank you. It is for you. Thank you. Stop doing this to yourself. Stop crying. I can't. You have to. <laughs> it's been four years. Four years and I can't even give you any child. <laughs> Honey, you're not the only one suffering this fact. I am not happy about that too. Let's keep our faith and our hope in God. <laughs> Let's continue to pray. I've lost my faith in you, God. You know you can't. One day he will, he will shine his light on our faces. No, you're sick and too long. It's okay. Come here. Sorry. Right. Come here. It's okay. It's okay. Stop. Please. Stop. Please. Please. <laughs>
Josie. Mm -hmm. Oh. <sighs> Andy. How long have you been standing here? I've been standing for some time. By the way, what's wrong with you? You don't look okay to me. How can I be okay? Tell me. How can I be okay when God has refused to give me a child? God will definitely give you a child at the right time. What time is the right time? What are you saying? Is four years not enough? Just put your feet in God. Trust him. This child will come. It's my wife. She's always crying and complaining. I, I, I don't know what to do. Um, you know, she needs to understand that it's not your fault. I think I will have to, to talk with her. Please, yeah. I, I would, I would love that. Man doesn't give children; only God does. God gives children. Then why has he refused to give me mine? Four years of marriage and no child? And you say God gives children? Do you now see what I've been telling you? Annabelle, you need to stop hurting yourself. Because even if you cry from now to tomorrow, nothing will change. All I need you to do is have faith in God. <laughs> Don't tell me about God. Don't tell me about God. God doesn't love me. Where is God? Where is God? Where is God? All these things are miscarriages, no pains. And you tell me God loves me. Don't you dare talk about God. That my wife is hurting. And why can't God give us a child? Even if it's just one. Why? Take a look at my wife. It's okay, bro. It's okay. God will surely give you a child of your own. Just be patient. At the right time, He will. Honey. You didn't follow the whole kitchen. Are you sure you're fine? Mm -hmm. Hey. Are you okay? Are you sure? Okay. You're very sure you're okay? Going to the shop today? No. I don't feel too well. It's okay. Just make sure you get enough rest, okay? I'll see you later in the evening. Drive safely.
Yes. Ah. Good morning, Patrick. Yes. What's with the excitement? Sir, my wife just gave birth to a bouncing baby boy this morning. A bouncing baby boy? <laughs> a bouncing baby boy. Wow, that, that is great news. <sighs> yes, sir. I, I'm here to ask her permission for me so I can go see her in the hospital. Yeah, you, you can go. Let's extend my regards to her and the baby. Thank you very much, sir. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. I'm happy for you. Congrats, yeah? Patrick better than me. Huh? God, is Patrick better than me? Honey, why are you still wearing the same outfit? Don't tell me you have not had your shower since morning. Welcome back, honey. How was work today? It was okay, but you still haven't answered my question. Why are you still wearing this dress? Didn't I tell you I wasn't feeling too well when you were going to work today? Yes, you did, but that shouldn't be the reason you're still wearing this dress. Excuse me, honey. Going on in this house? Huh? How come there's no food in the fridge or in the pot? What have you been doing all morning? You're sorry. You don't acknowledge my presence in this house anymore. Don't forget, you don't live in this house alone. What is all this now? Annabelle! Annabelle! I'm talking to you. What are you doing? You want to sleep without having your bath? Good night. I'm talking to you, you're telling me good night. Honey, you need to go have your bath. Honey. Honey. 
you need to have your bath, please. Honey? Hi. What do you mean you're not crying? I see tears all over your face. What is it? Upstairs and freshen up. I want to take you somewhere. Okay. All right. Let's go. go in this dress what is wrong with the dress after all you didn't tell me where you're taking me to honey what's going on with you huh you've been acting strange these days you don't take care of yourself anymore do you still want to go i should go back inside uh, it's okay um it's fine let's let's go Yes, Oga. Can't be this. Eh? Now, wow. Person who did this can't big house. Eh? No go still see food chop. Oh. Eh? Madam, self. No, the very reason say I never eat. Eh? I wish you say my belly na, na this thing rock the inside. Maji, I go even sell. 
If I know, if I for me even buy this wristwatch. I just use my salary to go buy this wristwatch. That was because I was seafood chop. Honey, where are you taking me to? To the hair salon. Is that what bothers you? What do you mean? Is this your problem? Is this what you're worried about? Honey, I am not worried about your hair. Okay, I just want you to have a change of hair, that's all. I'm sorry I did not tell you before bringing you out. Hello? Oh, Mama, how are you? I am not fine, Mama. Your daughter is making things very difficult for me. She does not do anything anymore in the house. She does not cook for me. She does not clean the house. She does not take care of herself. All she thinks about is her not being able to give me children. I, 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 I don't know what to do anymore, Mama. Mama, I have done everything. Yes. Honey, how long is this going to continue in this house? I'll leave this house in the morning without food and still come back and still you have food to eat. What is all this now? Huh? I'm talking to you. So you're just going to sit there and, and, and look into my face like that? Okay, you call me. Okay. I say, make I buy this one, make I use and help myself. Make I choke. You know, you see, everywhere, it does everywhere, it didn't lock down. So, as everywhere, they lock down now. I say, make I buy this one, make I use and help myself. And you put, no okay. Take this. Rush this for market. Yes, you got buy one carton of Indomie and then sardine. Okay. You say maybe I buy uh, sardine co use the change after you buy the Indomie to buy the sardine. Okay, okay. Uh, okay, no good man buy them for two carton. Then make I use the remaining. So what did I ask you to do? You say make I buy one carton of Indomie. So why are you asking me to buy two? Huh? No very sir. My friend, get out of here. Sorry, sir.
I made this for you. If you know you're not eating, I want you to eat something, yeah? Just something small. Okay? Small now, please. Babe. Take. I'm not hungry. What is going on with you? Huh? You hardly eat? You hardly take your shower? You don't take care of yourself anymore. What is all this? You don't even cook for me. What is this? Is it because of our childlessness? It is also affecting me. Do you know that? How can I be happy? How can I be happy when I don't have a child of my own? Honey, this is not your fault. Neither is it mine. God is going to give us a child. Why do you keep talking about this God? What? The same God who has left me childless? Baby. Honey, listen to me. Our child is going to come, okay? I just want you to eat and shower. Okay, okay you know what? I'll give you a nice massage. You know you love massages. Listen, if this is what bothers you, you can go ahead and do it. So who's going to eat this food now? You have not been to the shop for some days now. Why? Why are you not going to the shop? Have a nice day. Mama, your daughter has lost every reason to live happy as a woman. She does not care about anything or anyone anymore. She does not cook for me. She does not wash my clothes. She does not even take good care of herself. Mama, all she keeps saying is she does not have a reason to live properly anymore. Mama, I need your help. Yes, Mama. Oh, thank you so much. Okay, bye bye. Hey, Mama! Welcome! Welcome! Mommy! I mean, I'm doing fine, though. What's wrong with your stomach? Mommy! Mommy! Since morning, I never eat food for this house. We lie to lie. And I make her tell you the truth, Mama. I never eat up for anything. Since morning. My son, has he got into this? I'm asking you a question. Answer me. Sorry, Madam. It was Oka that brought me. He wants me to be taking care of the house since I'm not feeling too well. He wants you to be taking care of the house. 
Since I'm not feeling well. Very good. I just kill me, make I die for this. A man don't say I don't die. Eh? I go there for this big passion. Eh? I know the seafood chops. This money can never. What thousand naira bro? Now buy the chop. I no still buy the food. Eh? Buy butter the other. What do you mean? Carry this your bag. Go back to the shop because that is where you were employed. It's not going anywhere. Who do you mean, sir? I asked Thelma to come and take care of the house chores since she don't do it anymore. I will double her salary. Now take that bag to the guest room downstairs and prepare something for us to eat. Yes, sir. Let me take the bag. So all my son said, all that he said, is true. Anime. Mama, you didn't tell me you were coming. And must I take permission from you before I come to my son in law's house? Eh? So your son in law reported me to you. It's fine. You're here. Make yourself comfortable in your son in law's house. I'm funny. Is this my daughter? Or someone else? I told you this was going to happen. Don't conclude yet, just wait. I shouldn't conclude yet. Okay. We'll see. Dizzy and weak. I hope it's not what I'm thinking. What are you thinking? You know what? Um, just stay right here. Let me get the car keys. We need to see a doctor right I'll away. Sleepers. Don't worry, I'll get it. I would have always wanted to be a mom, honey. Yeah, yeah. Today my heart has come to pass. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much for this great gift, baby. Did I give you any gift? It's God who gave us this gift. True, that's true. It's God who gives children, not me. That's very true. Oh, and also, I'm the one that did all the work, you know, making sure that... Um... <laughs> <laughs> um.
Honey. Honey, wake up, wake up, get up. You're bleeding. You're bleeding so bad. The baby. Oh my God. Oh my God, I, I need to call the doctor. Hello? Uh, Dr. Chelsea, my wife is bleeding so bad. Okay, okay, uh, we're coming right away. Bye-bye. We have to go to the hospital. Hey! How are you, my love? I'm fine, thank you. How was your day? It was good. How was your day? I'm so tired. Very hectic. Yes, very, very hectic. Oh, uh, that reminds me. Were you able to see the doctor like you said? Yes. Good. What did she say? We're expecting parents. Oh. Right. Okay. Honey. Yes? You don't seem happy about the news. How can I be happy? Tell me. When I live with the fear of losing another child. Baby, this is the fourth pregnancy. Yet, we are childless. I don't know. this God? Why? What is the point in giving us a stem without fruits? We have lost our first, second, third, and now this is our fourth child. How many times do we have to get a miscarriage? Why? Look at my wife. Take a look at me. Are you happy we are living like this? And you think you're God? This is not fair. This is not fair at all. I am so sorry. But no amount of tears is going to bring our baby back. Please.
Yes. Yes, I'm fine. I'm alright. No, you shall not. You're crying. <laughs> Annabelle, I am fine. I'm fine. See, I'm not crying. I'm not crying. Mama, why are you crying? Is it because of me? Is it because of what I'm going through? My child, I don't know why God can give you and my son-in-law a child of your own. My son-in-law is a good man. And you are a decent girl. What is going on? Why can't you be I'm a child of your own. I've had four miscarriages in three years. I'm even scared of getting pregnant. Because pain and sorrow always overshadow my happiness. Drop it here. You'll be fine. I'm here. Okay. Let's take my child. Because the food is set and she's still laying down here. Annabelle, are you okay? I'm fine. Oh, thank God you're fine. Your husband said uh, that breakfast is served. So get up and go for your breakfast. I'm not hungry. It's okay. Even if you're not hungry, can you just take a sip from the tea or just take a slice of the bread. Okay? Get up. Get up on it. Get up. Mama, I said I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry. Are you shouting at your mother? Huh? Annabelle, are you I shouting? I said I am not hungry. Am I a baby? Do you want to feed me? Hey. It's okay. It's okay, son. Ah, we just come here. You can go and eat yourself. Talk to her. My daughter. Please. Punishing myself is the only way God can grant my request. And I will continue to do it. Come here, my child. I know how you feel. But the truth is, being so hard on yourself will not make God to give answers to your prayers. Please, just have to stop this. 
Stop. <laughs> Have you ever imagined the state of your husband's heart <laughs> with this your continuous sad moments? You cry and your husband cries. And there is no space for the child to even come in. Become mom. You have to stop this. Stop. So that God will give answers to your prayers. Go. God. This same God everybody keeps talking about. Oh, please, I just want to be left alone. But please, I want you to give a thought to what I said. While you think about yourself, also think about your husband. How he feels. Because two of you are in the not just you alone. has been medically tested and proven to be okay and compatible baffles me. What then could be the problem? I don't know. I seriously don't know. She doesn't... She doesn't do anything. She doesn't eat. She doesn't take care of herself. She's not the same happy woman I married. How I just wish God would just... Surprise her with a, with, with a baby. Um, well, you just have to keep your faith alive. I believe someday God will send you a child of your own. Mm. Just keep praying. I don't know what to do to make her laugh in her fear. You know, I called her mom to the house and she's still not happy, even with her mom around. Wow. Serious. said you wanted to tell us something. Yes. Um, I will be leaving for the village tomorrow. So soon? Yes, I received a call from the village this morning that uh, the village tax force boys raided my shop. Why? Are you owing them? Your mother-in-law is not a debtor. Not after all you did for me. That's the more reason I want to go back to the village to find out why they raided my shop. That's okay. Um, I 
Mana Pak? I will be going back to the village by tomorrow morning. Okay. And I want you to take good care of your husband, your home, your business, and most importantly, yourself. Be go. We give you your own children, not just a child. You have the many boys, girls, and I'll be busy taking care of them. You know, go. Oh. And my son, please take good care of my daughter. I will. She needs you so much now. Please. And uh, thank you so much for coming to stay with us this short while. It's okay. You are her strength, my strength. I will put of you to take care of each other. Thank that you. will give me life. You mm? will. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Take care of my daughter while I return back to the village. Mama, I will. She is my responsibility. My child, I want to come to say goodbye to her. I wonder if she will ever be alright from this. Mama, don't worry, she'll be alright. I am here for her. I will take very good care of her, okay? Just don't worry. Let, let's go. Please. Bye bye. Bye bye. Mom, why are you here all alone? Hi, baby. Come on. Wait. 
very, very soon, I promise. Thelma! Thelma! Sir? Come. Welcome, sir. Where's your madam? Sir, I don't know where she has gone to. Is she not in the kitchen? No, she's not. I haven't seen her since this afternoon. What? What do you mean you have not seen her since afternoon? Sir, I mean she's not in the house. How can you tell me you did not see my wife leave this compound? Are you, t are you telling me that she, she disappeared? Oga, okay. <laughs> I know they lie you. I go lie, Oga. Okay. I don't see Madame come up for this gate. I only see Madame walk up past. You must be very stupid. What's the difference between leaving and pass? Oga, okay. she don't leave. She pass. Shut up, man. I, I get very, very stupid. What's wrong with you? you you're still challenging me. Mm -hmm. Huh? No, Oga. No, Oga. No challenge. No challenge at all. Oga. You hear that? Open the gate. You hear that? Open the gate. Honey, where have you been? I've been worried. Um, I went to get our baby. Our baby? Yes, our baby. Baby, say hello to daddy. Hi, daddy. <laughs> She's saying hi. <laughs> Hello, you're just going to exit so she can relax. Eh? <laughs> so, what's wrong with Manda? Huh? You didn't have to start telling me. Manda, no, Kolo, Manda. What's wrong with you? Eh? Are you mad? What, what, what is wrong with you? Ah! ah. Yeah, Mama, we don't Kolo. Oh, God, sorry. Oh, God, sorry. I'm going to kill you. When will you let you go? This is okay. If you like it, shut me. You know, because I mean, the truth be said, Madam, I don't call you mentor. But, ah, you don't call you mentor, Kelly. What is going on here? Huh? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What is this? This? Her baby. I had to bring her home. How is that our baby? That is a teddy bear, a she, toy! Shh! Wait, wait, stop! She, she's sleeping, you're going to stop her. How can you be calling that our baby? Huh? Don't do it. I mean, this, this, this is not funny anymore. No! No, 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 She's sleeping. What is wrong with you? It's a toy. That is not our baby. Baby, don't! What do you want to do to her? Do you want to hurt her? 
Um, I'm sorry, baby. Can you just walk up? You have a stress with your work. It's already stressed. I'm not that you okay. Um, sorry, it's getting upset. Hey, little baby, please don't cry. Mommy is here. We haven't prayed. Stop that. What's wrong yeah. with you? Huh? I want to feed my baby. Feed which baby? Can you stop this? This is the teddy bear we feed with baby. Stop. Only stop it! Stop, stop it! Stop. I will not allow you to do this. How can you feed a teddy bear? Tell me you're feeding your, your, your baby. That's my baby. Don't call it. That is not your baby. Sorry, baby. Can you stop it? Stop! What is wrong with you? You're getting me angry. You're getting me angry. I said, Stop. But she's hungry. A teddy bear is hungry. Can you even listen, listen to what you're, you're, you're telling me? That's my baby. That's not a teddy bear. She hasn't eaten anything. Don't listen to that, JK. That is stressed out and he's hungry too. Hmm? Mmm, mmm, yummy. Ah! Why are you shouting? And the things are getting worse. I think my wife is losing it. Why would you say that? What has she done? Can you believe yesterday she went to buy a teddy bear? Telling me that she went to bring our baby. She sees and takes care of the teddy bear like a baby. Can you imagine? What? You mean she, she said that? Yes, and earlier on, she was feeding the teddy bear instead of feeding herself. What happened to her? Why has she changed all of a sudden? I don't know. She's been acting strange these past weeks. She, she has lost every reason to smile. As it is right now, I am confused. I, I, I don't know what to do. Bro, this is, this is serious. What do you intend to do now? That is why I called you to come over to advise me. Because, I don't know. Um, I'm sorry, but there's, there's only one way right now. And what is that? You take her to a psychiatric. Yes, because from the things you've said, those are early signs of madness. That's the only option, bro. Yeah. Stop. What do you want? Hmm? Don't cry, baby. Mommy's here, okay? Stop crying. Hmm? Just take this, baby. You don't want this still, so what do you want? Huh? What do you want? Mommy's here for you, okay? You want to breast? Would you take that? Problem. Your brother is not fine, okay? I need to see you. Okay. Hi. Mm. So, do you want daddy to carry you? Honey? Yeah? I think she wants you to carry her, please. Hmm? Me to carry. Yeah. Mm. Okay. See, Daddy is here. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> 
You <laughs> 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 see, she's no longer crying. No, you're being too hard on her. Baby, stop! Sorry. Don't mind that, you okay? My princess. Oh, I love you. There she is. Uh -huh. This is serious. You know, a friend advised I take her to the psychiatric hospital. No, brother. I don't like the idea. I think this is spiritual. No medical. You know, I feel the same way too. Brother, my reverend father is a powerful man of God. Please, can you permit me to talk to him? So he will come and pray for her. <sighs> my reverend father has been praying for her and is still praying. I just hope your reverend father can find a solution to her predicament. Yes, brother. I know my father very well. He's powerful and highly connected to God. <sighs> thank you. No, brother. You don't have to thank me. Do not forget she's my sister-in-law and a very good one at that. Okay. All right, she will be fine, okay? in heaven release her from every bondage that she has been captured amen amen in the name of the father and of the son and of the holy spirit amen. let the peace of the lord be upon this house amen Joseph, where's the mother in law She's in the village. That's where she lives. I want to see her. I hope all is well. Yes, um, but anything I have to say will be in her presence. Okay. I can say anything to you in her absence. That's fine. So please do everything possible to make sure that she's here. And please call me. I'll do that. I will. How much? How much? How much? I've told you it's 600 naira. 600 naira. Mama and I'm paying. Eh? Things cost, you know, too much. I know say things cost. That's why I sell at 500 naira because you come here buy every time. See, eh? Ma, I give you 400. But I take 500. For, bring money. Bring my phone, the ring. I bring my answer my call. Hello? Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Good afternoon. Nah, how are you? How can you want me back to the city? I just left there a few uh, weeks ago. It's not even weeks. It's about my daughter, right? Mama. Hmm. <laughs> this is my stupid. Hmm. Papa <laughs> is full, full, full. Honey, what are you doing? this? Huh? What are you doing? I'm trying to date her. She hasn't had a bath since morning. You want, you want to bath a teddy bear in what I bought for our baby? 
This is our baby, honey. She's going to cry if you scold her. Don't do that. What is this? You're going to scare her. Sorry, baby. Honey, hmm? honey, look at me. This is for our baby, not for a teddy bear. Honey, this is our baby. No, this is a teddy bear. Sit here, baby. Mm. Your mommy makes your water. Stop, stop, stop. Baby, stop, 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 What happened to my daughter? She has been like this for some days now. It all started when she brought this teddy bear to this house. Hey! Hey! Oh. Jesus. My enemies at it. They have come. Huh? What is the meaning of this? Mama, 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 please calm down. I need to know what the meaning of this I is. Know, that's, that's what we're trying to figure out. Just calm down. A reverend father came to pray for her and asked me to invite you. I don't know what the reason is, but I am glad you're here. I will call him and tell him that you have arrived. Please do now. Please do. My child. This is not a child, but a teddy bear, big one. You don't need to cuddle it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's not your child, it's because you stop seeing her. Stop! That's my baby. Hey! Has done this. Hey! No, no. I'm sorry, baby. I'm hmm? so sorry. Don't mind, Grandma, okay? Mommy's here. Hi! What is this? Mm. Okay. Okay. Daddy. Stop. Just stop. Mama, stop. 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 Can you just stop? Mama, you stop. stop. I asked your son in law here to invite you. The last time I was praying with her, the Holy Spirit ministered to me. Um, Reverend Father, what is wrong with my daughter? And um, what did the Holy Spirit reveal to you concerning her? The Holy Spirit ministered to me that you are responsible for your daughter's predicament. It's I time you speak up now. Else, your daughter will start running mad and nothing can be done to help her gain back her sanity. Hey! Hey! What you did in the past is a repercussion of what she's going through right now. It is only the truth that can help revive her. Like the Bible said, speak the truth and the truth will set you free. Wise woman, my daughter is really suffering. She has been married for four good years, yet she does not have a seed of her own. Each time she gets pregnant, she ends up losing the child. Mm. You are the cause of your daughter's predicament. Who gave her hand in marriage? Who? Wise woman, I don't understand your question. Okay. When she's about getting married, who gave her hands to the in-laws? Think. And I also want to let you know that I want you to represent her father by giving out her hand in marriage. 
Oh, this is good news. But it is not possible for me to do that. But how do you expect me to do that even if your husband is dead? It's not possible. Um, my brother-in-law, you are the only one that I have in this village now. What is out? So I know you can do it for me. You're the only one around now. That is not true. She still has one of her late father's elder brother, who happens to be my brother. Yes. Uh, well, he's staying in Joss. Uh, you don't expect me to travel all the way to Joss just to invite him to come and give out my daughter's hand in marriage when I have you here. I still insist you allow your late husband's elder brother take the responsibility of handing over your daughter's hand in marriage and not me. I am just one of his kinsmen. My, my, my in-law, please, I can't do that. Eh? And besides, I, 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 I can't do that. Not after all he did to me while, while his late brother was still alive. Eh? Now you want me to go all the way to just to, just to go and invite him like that. But no, no. Um, I, I can't because... Aruka. No. I am very sorry to disappoint you on this one. I can't help it. it, it it's just not possible. No, I am sorry too. Because I, I won't go to uh, uh, Joss. Joss said, Teka, no, no. Uwa, Osa. Can you get just tell it? We all are not a corner to you. Oh, Teka, I can't go there. I don't want to be my well. It's all right. Yes, you are right. I wouldn't advise you to travel all the way to the Joss. Just to see someone who doesn't know you exist. I mean, someone who doesn't know your value. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Blood is thicker than water, my brother. See why I love you. Because I know you are the one that will understand my predicament. It's only you that will understand where I am coming from. Tell me, eh, how will I travel all the way to Joss? Just to go and invite a man to come, come and hand my daughter's hand over to, uh, uh, to another man. And I'm to him, eh? eh? Marriage or, or death sentence. Wait, wait, wait. Even if her father is late, what of the king's men? Oh. What are they doing? Uh, uh, because uh, that is why they are your in-laws. I just told you. I want one of them. I presented my case like I came to you. Osim Cha. That he won't stand in gap, in gap for anybody. He will not represent my little husband. Instead, that he wants me to travel all the way to Joss. To go and call the man. If I get there, he will say he won't come to. Not is too far. Couple with the bad roads. No, 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 no. No, no, no. no. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, sister. You know what? Whenever you're ready to meet your in-laws, let me know. Hey, hey, I'll stand by you. Oh, ah. Why am I walking under the sun? Hey. If I'm not, I'm not going to help me. No, ah, because we're headed there. What you, my brother? Is, is it not just to stand? Thank you, my brother. No, no, Case is finished. I'll be there for you. Ah, the house is gone there. Let them end the gun. I don't have any problem again. Thank you so much. Oh, didn't them because why are you kidding? I gave it to you. Come on, come on. Oh, no, why? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 I'm mm. taking it small, small. Oh, well, well, well. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. <laughs> um, my in-law, it shall be well with you. He said, I bless this your union today. He said, you have your own child, you have boys, you have girls, as many as you want. He said, whatsoever that is your heart's desire, as you're stepping into this union today, you will have it. Huh? He said, your possession. He said, Thank you very much, sir. 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 Thank you very much,
What bad news are you talking about? Have you not heard? I said I have not. You said you heard bad news. Did they send you to come and meet me with the bad news? Nah. The death of your brother Odinaka. How? She may go him. Odinaka won them. How? Where? What happened to him? I overheard what people. Him? I overheard people saying that it was the evil that you and your brother did. What nonsense are you talking about? What happened to my brother? What do you mean by the evil we commit? Which evil? Nah. I heard people saying that it was the evil that you did with your brother by giving Annabelle, your daughter, out for marriage while her late father's elder brother is still alive. Ah. Nah. Ah. No, it's not possible. It's a lie. It's not possible. I was with my brother a few weeks ago. This cannot happen to him. It's not what happened to him. People have not told me what happened to my brother. So how, how can like I want them just die? I don't know. Something is. Chineke mo, chineke mo, chineke mo do. Can you remember now? Yes, I do. Good. That was the beginning of your daughter's predicament. The rival person who's supposed to do the blessing was ignored. Instead, the wrong person was asked to bless her. And that led to his death within two days after the marriage, who happened to be your own brother. Hey, hey, Wu. Hey, Wu. Wise one, please. Yes. How do we bring solution to this predicament that I brought upon my daughter and my son-in-law? Okay, the only solution is for you to travel to the north where your husband and her brother is still living. Go and apologize to him so that he can come back and bless the marriage and your daughter. Without that, your daughter will not have any seed. The same thing you didn't do when the herbalist told you is the repercussion of what your daughter is going through right now. Mama, how come you never told me about this? Huh? I'm sorry. I did everything I would have could do to make her daughter happy. Or see what your happiness has cost my wife! I'm sorry. The solution to this. Sule! Sule! Yes, Oga! Ha! Oga, are you here? Have you washed this car? Yes, I don't clean everything, sir. Why is the floor not wet? Oga, I... I don't know the floor not wet. Are you mad? Who's going to clean that car? Oga... Look, 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 look at this idiot. The solution to this problem is that you have to travel to Joss to meet your husband's brother. Ask for his forgiveness and the right for another marriage. By so doing, your daughter will gain back her sanity and possibly give birth to a child. <laughs> Please, friend. Please. Help me, please, to my son in law. Ask him to forgive me, please. How did you start? Uh. 
She says she's sorry. Well, let me remind you something. Jesus Christ came to the world to die. Regardless of our imperfections. died for our sins. So why is it so difficult for you to forgive this little sin she committed? After what she has done to her own daughter, my wife is in that condition because of her. She's evil. I understand. Yes. But you have to find a place in your heart to forgive her. I cannot forgive her for what she has done. She's a mother and mothers have their daughters at heart. I believe that whatever she did is to vindicate her daughter. You have to forgive her. You have a pure heart, a heart that can forgive. All I needed to do right now is to focus Father, on... Uh, please, if you don't mind, can I drop you off? Shall we? I am so disappointed in my mother-in-law. I can never forgive her for this. Because of her, my wife's life is a mess. You know, for a mother and an elderly woman who has lived all her life in the village, she ought to understand customs and traditions. Because there are certain things about tradition that Christianity cannot overlook. That is why I believe she knew what she did. Please take it easy, bro. Don't stress yourself. You know, instead of getting worked up over what she's done, I advise you channel that energy into finding solutions to your wife's predicaments. Yeah. That is true. I, I already know what to do. Mm, I have to do something good. I'm so sorry, my daughter. Please forgive me. I'm the one that caused all this. I brought you to this. <laughs> Mommy, you don't have to cry. You make me get the best gift. The best, best gift. Right, baby? <laughs> Oh, that is here. Let's see. Ah, that is here. See, Daddy. Say hi, Daddy. Hi. Daddy, Daddy. Daddy, 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 Daddy. daddy. <laughs> okay. Don't worry, I'm you just when you're from past, you can go play with Daddy, okay? Okay. Mama, instead of you sitting here crying, I think you should do what Father said. Because you're the reason for my wife's condition. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. That is the only way I forgive you. 
sorry. Daddy, uh uh. Daddy, maybe you need to come. Where are you going to? I should be asking you this question. How can I sleep when I know the person responsible for my wife's predicament is under my roof? Brother, I know how you feel. But why not go to the north with Mama? So you join her and ask him for forgiveness. Also tell him that you were not aware of the plan. Maybe by doing so, he might forgive you. You know, you have a point. But it won't be that easy. I know. But you can make it easy. Just do it for your wife. Well, only if she'll agree to follow me to Joss. You have to talk to her in the morning. <sighs> Mama, I uh, called you so we can talk about my wife's predicaments. And also to let you know that I have forgiven you. Hmm. Thank you so much, my son-in-law. It's okay. I have always known that you are a man with a good heart. Um, you heard what the father said. Yes. You are the only one that can solve the problem in my family. Hmm. And I would love you to accompany me to just to see my little husband's brother. Um, that's great. Uh, when do you want us to? Tomorrow, if it's okay. Bye. Yes, it's it's fine. We can go early tomorrow morning. I will book our flights right away. <laughs> thank you. It's okay, Mama. You don't need to thank me, Mama. <clears throat> Annabelle is my wife and I'll do anything to get her back to the woman I married. I mean, I, I can't wait to see children running around the house. I am so sorry. I was the reason you and your wife suffered this much. I'm so sorry. Stop blaming yourself. The deed has already been done. I know you did what you thought was right and what was right to protect her. Please, just let it go. Okay? Hmm? Honey. Yeah. I'll be traveling with your mother to see your uncle in Joss. He's the only one that can get you out of this predicament. Mm -hmm. 
I want you to take very good care of yourself whilst I'm away, okay? And the baby? Yes, and the baby. Don't worry, we will be fine. We will be all right, okay? By the time I get to just to see your uncle, all of this will come to an end. I started this, and I will make sure you come out of it. I will be leaving now. Mm -hmm. You see, come right, Lily. It's okay. It's okay, my dear. I'm going to be just you and I. All right, mom. And the house. You and mommy. Say bye bye to grandma. Say bye, grandma. Come right, Lily. See, come right, Lily. Say bye, grandma. Bye bye, grandma. It's just you and I in the house now. Hmm? Just tell Mama anything you want, and Mama's going to give it to you, okay? That's my girl. Um, Tracy, I want you to take very good care of my wife whilst I'm away. Okay, brother. She will be fine before you return. I believe so. Mother, start going before you miss your flight. Yes. And please, take very good care of Mama. I will. You know she's like a mother to me. All right. Mm. Bye. Take care. Okay. Right, bye. Sir. Huh? Sir, I know you and Mama are traveling, so I decided to wake up very early and prepare food for you and Mama. Oh. But since you don't have time, I decided to package the food so you guys can eat at the car when you get to the airport. Wow, Emma, uh, this is very thoughtful of you. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thoughtful of you. Thank you. Thank you. Mama, bye bye. Bye. Come on, please keep this on the back. Thank you. Andy. Bye bye. For someone, yes, I'm looking for my brother in law, oh. Mr. Amadi. Amadi, Amadi, is it the one average height and dark in complexion? Coach? Yes, 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 he's the one I'm talking about. I want to go and see him. Uh, please, that does he still live here? We really need to see him. He has not been around for one week now. He felt seriously sick and he was rushed to his village. I pray he gets better. Won't lie, it was bad. Please, sorry. Help. We have to go back. Yes, fast, fast. We can. Yes. yes. I, I will call Father too. Let's go back. Let's go. Let's go.
The devil is a liar. Yes, sir, Reverend Father. The devil is a liar. The devil wants my son-in-law and my daughter to suffer for the rest of their lives. But not again. He has failed woefully. He can never succeed. We will have to go to the village. And I will advise that we hire Siena. Josie, I don't want you to be driving because of the stress you are in. Mrs. Annabelle will have to come with us to the village so that her uncle can bless her marriage. Amen. And we must do this as quick as possible. Um, Father, my friend owns a Siena. He can take us to the village. Okay, okay? and that's a good idea. Um, Ma, please, I'd like you to go upstairs and get your daughter ready. Okay, thank you, Father. Yes. No. Um, sorry. Holy Spirit, guide and protect us as we embark on this journey. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.
We can't tell if it's okay. We heard him scream a few minutes ago. That is why we came down here. We are nearby Neville's. His condition is looking critical. So we call his uncle over. He's inside with him. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm saying something not too comfortable. My son, bring my daughter. Oh, okay. Let's go inside. Bring my father. Please, can we go inside? Near before him and beg for forgiveness. My Elio, please forgive me. By alone, I have gone against tradition and have wronged you. I am sorry, please. I did all this by giving out your late brother's daughter's hand in marriage through my late brother. And this has made my daughter and her husband not to have a child of their own. And now, My daughter is almost insane because of this act. Because, why Aluba? I'm sorry. Forgive me, and also forgive them, please. I wasn't just when I heard you wanted to give at our daughter hand in marriage without consulting me. I felt hurt. I felt neglected and I knew if my brother had been alive, he cannot insult me that way. All the ancestors. And I placed the curse on her that she would never bear a child in that marriage. Uh, for my sake. I beg of you to take off the curse you have placed on my wife. Please. Please. It's not my daughter's fault. It's not my in-law's fault. Set both of them free and punish me instead. Let me take whatever punishment that comes from you, Miko, please. Just cancel the curse and lay it on me, please. Jesus Christ died on the cross of Calvary for us. For you. Which means that you can forgive her, regardless of the sin that she has committed. Know this, forgiveness is divine. Amadi, please find a place in your heart and forgive her. Please. Bring my daughter and her husband to me. Okay. <laughs> my daughter. From this day, I bless your marriage. You shall be fruitful. You bear male and female children. My in-law, you enjoy the fruit of your labor. The money you will need to train our grandchildren, you will not lack. Amadi! 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 Hey! Be cold, I don't want to be cold on you! Amadi! Hey! Honey. Yes. 
What's going on? I will explain more. Why is another I just lost it. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I May you so rest in the bosom of the Almighty, the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Oh.